listen Do your own math And learn from the stuff that you are missing Create your own path With your own vision Hey This is Rodney Porter For Homeless Not Helpless Dot TV Today's date February 24th, 2010, Wednesday. We have a real good show today. It's entitled, I Know I'm Struggling, But I'm Making It. What do I mean by that? I know I'm struggling, but I'm making it. First of all, anytime you're upright, standing straight up, you're doing all right. I'd rather be vertical than horizontal, if you know what I mean. Is this, this is just something that needs to be said when it comes to struggling. We all struggle, but when we get depressed, it's called quicksand, and it's not, struggling means a continuous, for me, a personal definition is continuous agony and pain, never ending. And so when you're in quicksand, it's just a matter of time. That means all your hope is gone. You never ever in your life think in your mind that anything is going to work out, anything. You just don't have any confidence. You don't have a clue of what's going on. And you just perpetuate the myth or the stereotype of a homeless person. Down and out. I can't make it. Could you help me? Give me some money. No, not with me. I hear at Homeless Not Helpless TV is just as the title entails. I'm homeless, but I'm not helpless. Just like so many millions of others around. And struggling is just what we do. We struggle when we're a youth. We struggle at adolescence. We struggle at being an adult, being a father, being a son, being a great worker. But you cannot give up. When you give up, you do not make it. I'm making it because of all the things I've done regarding listening to my mom. My mom always did the right thing, told the truth, not just because I was her son. She's a woman that told the truth and will tell the truth and continuously tells the truth. Every time it's wrong, she will correct you. So I know right from wrong, where, where to go, who to hang around with. And it's just one of those things where if you don't learn, you'll get caught up in a real, real situation and get twisted up all out of proportion for no reason. I had to stay focused because I knew I had to struggle to get better. I knew I had to struggle to get better. And that just totally helped me struggling. I know my mom always says, you didn't have to learn the hard way. But I've always had things given to me my whole life. Up until, of course, you get 25 and you're off your mom's insurance and things are harder now. And then it kind of takes a little time to get, you know, find your way, hit your stride. So struggling is all part of it. It's normal. It's nothing wrong with struggling. But again, struggling is ING. It's continuous. It's ongoing. And I'm getting out of that cycle now. I have an opportunity to be very, very happy with my future because I have something to do about that. I'm stepping up and doing something about that. My future is in my hands. All these cliches are true. Somebody didn't just make them up for no reason. It's true, damn it. I know I'm struggling, but I'm making it. The SSI has come. 
now I'm back in the, in the car for a couple of more months because I have to have it right for my kids. I know most people say, you stupid. Well, I disagree with you. I'm just being smarter now about my decisions. If I've been in this situation, living in my car for five years, I can wait two more months to have the right situation, to not have to struggle, to not lay on the floor when I get my place, and you guys will see that. You know, this is a inspirational situation here at Home is Not Helpless. I'm the ambassador of all things possible, all things. I'm spreading the word. I'm giving the good news. I'm becoming a resource around the country, around the world, and more importantly, to myself and to my family. My friends, they don't understand. They don't get it. They think I'm crazy. How dare you let people know your situation? If I can help somebody, I'm a helper because I'm helping myself. So why not? If I'm struggling, we all go struggle and get the answers together. That's what this is about. Life-changing advice here at Home is Not Helpless TV. Whew, it's raining. See this beautiful weather we have. Anytime we're in Los Angeles, it's still beautiful. Still beautiful. See the clouds? It doesn't matter. Because I'm here in Los Angeles, California. Things are looking up. God is good all the time. So if you are struggling, keep your head straight. Stay around the right people because they can bring you down. Misery loves company. And just be smart about your decisions. Don't work hard. Work smarter. I've always worked hard. I, I've been surviving out here working hard. But it's time to, as a, being the handyman would do, Use his head. Think. We all struggle. But we all we all can make it though. One reporter's opinion. This is Rodney Porter broadcasting live here at wonderful, gloomy, drizzly, rainy Los Angeles. Be safe. Have a good one. See you.